back to our channel or welcome if you're new. I'm Stephanie, stay at home wife, homeschooling mama to four. Today, I'm just gonna carry y'all along with me. We are sitting here at the table doing all of our school work. Sage is working on her November calendar because today is the first day of November. It's closer to Thanksgiving, closer to Christmas. I think I'm probably gonna do my Christmas decorations if I can get my house good and clean, we're gonna do Christmas decorations probably next week. Mm -hmm. Nobody hollered at for me on that. Do y'all know? <laughs> little late reaction there. <laughs> Hazy brain. She's making some pooping noises with her mouth over there. She's supposed to be working on her multiplication tables. Uh, no, they're not hard. You know how to do them. But I have not even got myself ready for today. I still have on yesterday's makeup. But you know what? I'll get it washed off when I wash it off. <laughs> it's already 2 o'clock. We got a really late start. Caden has finished all of his work except for geometry. He has to have help with his geometry. And uh, he's outside mowing grass right now. Shawler's upstairs working. And I'm helping with these two down here at the kitchen table. It's cooler outside. So we're having to do work inside today. But so far, that is all I've gotten done. I have washed a load of clothes. And guess what, y'all? I took my dishwasher apart this morning. And I soaked everything in bleach. And I cleaned everything with a toothbrush. And I, I put some bleach in the bottom of it. It works. And, and I turned it on and let it clean on the mm. inside. Mm. And then mm. I loaded it down with dishes and it worked. It worked. It worked. Ah. We're so excited. That's I'm cool. so excited. I don't have to hand wash dishes anymore. <laughs> what is um, what? Is what? 10 times 11. 10 times 11. Oh, it was like 111. No, not 111. Remember when you're multiplying what times it? 10. One, zero, one. I'm done. Not 101. One. Remember, put your 11 down there and add how many, how many zeros does a 10 have? Yeah. So you're going to have one zero to the end of 11. And that's your answer. So it's 110. So 111? No, 110. Getting a little confused here now. But, okay. but anyway, we're gonna finish our work. I'm gonna cook supper tonight. We're having tuna patties, stewed potatoes, corn, mac and cheese, and cornbread. So that's what I'm cooking for supper tonight. I probably won't get to eat anything but the potatoes and the corn. Can't have the rest of it. That stinks. All right, we're gonna finish up school because I got a lot I gotta take care of. Y'all, I cannot seem to get myself going today. It is almost three o'clock. It's 10 till three right now. And I'm gonna make myself another coffee. I just put a uh, heavy whipping cream in it. I don't know if you can see that. The lighting is really bad over here. But I put my heavy whipping cream in and then oh, one of the girls left a snowball cappuccino in there. Oh, I think I'm going to do this Donut Cafe Salted Caramel. We'll try that one. I had not tried that one yet. I tried the Coconut Caramel. There was a hair on that. It looked like a person hair. <laughs> uh, anyway, I've tried the Coconut crum Crumble out of that big donut coffee blend box that I got from Ollie's the other day. The thing was awesome. It tastes so good. So this is the first time I'm gonna be trying the, um, what was it I put in there, salted caramel. So yeah, I, I'm, I'm getting me another thing of coffee and then I'm gonna use uh, the caramel macchiato that I got from Aldi to sweeten it with. I don't use sugar or anything in my coffee. I just use creamer and heavy whipping cream. I don't think I've tried this one from, it smells good. I don't think I've tried this one from Aldi yet. I know I've tried their vanilla caramel and I've tried their coconut cream. It is really, really good. So maybe I can get myself motivated with another thing of coffee. Hopefully, cause I got a lot to do. My house is a disaster. Oh, 
Oh my goodness. Yeah, this is gonna be like heaven here. Alright. Gonna drink my cup of coffee. One more cup for the day and then I'll have to cut it off because I won't be able to go sleep tonight. <laughs> This kid is still out here mowing. <laughs> he is mowing everything, I think, which he loves to mow. Paisley's up there in the arena playing her and Minnie Pearl. And the two, I call them my two S's, Schaller and Sage are out in the round pen right out there. Y'all just overlook this stuff. They've been playing with junk in the yard. But Schaller is riding Chubby, and Sage is riding Twister. And they're just riding in our little round pen out beside of our barn. Because we still haven't gotten our other one set up yet. It's probably going to take a few weeks to get it set up. We've still got to go pick some rocks up out of the arena. I think he's just driving that lawnmower around. But um, our neighbor is going to come over, and we've got one, I think, low spot out in the arena and he's gonna come and fix it and we're gonna get the panels started being put up the shoots and everything will be put up too oh my word i just heard paisley dying laughing you can't see him because the tractor is in the way but the arena is up there behind this tractor and kaden is <laughs> driving the lawnmower around the barrels. It's like he's running barrels on the lawnmower. <laughs> I don't know if you get, here he goes. He's fixing to turn the third barrel. Oh, that was a real wide turn. <laughs> oh, I guess he gave up. <laughs> I finally got in there and got myself a shower and cleaned up for the day and it's already like supper time. So I'm gonna go in here and cook supper. On my menu today, I have the tuna patties, stewed potatoes. I think I already told y'all all that. So I gotta get in there and get that cooked because it's almost time for my husband to come home from work. And here comes the lawnmower. I think he's finished, finally finished. <laughs> he's doing the lazy man's way of shutting the gate. I guess that's a positive for having big, huge hands. <laughs> See, he's working the, he's working the lawnmower the zero turn lawnmower with one hand because he didn't want to get off of it to go <laughs> lock the gates. I think the girls are going up there to ride in the arena now just without the panels. Those two horses can be trusted without having to have panels up so they're gonna go up there and ride. Probably run the barrels up there. <laughs> attention to my nasty nasty stove I'm in here cooking supper right now I have my stewed potatoes I just put potatoes chicken broth salt and butter in it to cook those now I'm going to try something different with our green beans and I'm going to I don't know how I'm gonna do this <laughs> I'm just making up some stuff as I go I guess it takes four cans of green beans, four regular sized cans of green beans to feed my kids and myself and my husband. So, oh, it is what it is. I'm going to drain all the water off of these. So just bear with me here just a minute. Somebody coming in from, he's been out there mowing again, y'all. I think you've been mowing all day, haven't you? Since about one o'clock. And it's already, what, five? Yeah. All right, got all those. 
goes to the right. Yeah, it probably will be the last time you got a bow. One can. Two can. Three cans. And four cans. Yeah. All right, I think I'm just going to refill this with just water. Um, yeah, probably just water this time. Since I've already used the whole thing with chicken broth. I was going to do corn. I had corn on the menu, but green beans just sounded better. Alright, got my water in there now. Turn it on. Make sure I get the right one. I always get confused with the stove. It's not marked for a dumb person. It's marked for smart people and I don't think I am that yet. a stick of salted butter. I don't know if you can even see that right now because the light. There we go. <laughs> That's better. My lighting is not very good in here in the kitchen. So I'm going to put a half a stick of butter. I never get it open. A little bit more than a half a stick. crumbled bacon. It's probably going to be some good green beans. Give it a little bit of flavor. A little bit more. That should be enough. Alright, now I've got to find something to cook some mac and cheese in. Alright, I'm going to get some mac and cheese put on. All right, y'all, we've already eaten supper. Uh, these are the stewed potatoes. They were yummy. And then there was my cornbread. Jonathan is the only one that ate a piece of cornbread. Kids usually don't eat cornbread. They don't like it. And then the green beans were the bomb. Those things were really good. Put that bacon and stuff in them. Mm -mm -mm. So good. And then the mac and cheese. I bought this mac and cheese from Aldi and I'm really I'm not impressed with it. It's like I cooked it the way I always cook mac and cheese. It's really good. It's cheesy and it's good. Well, Sage likes it, but the noodles are like stuck together and gummy. Yeah. They're kind of disgusting. It comes out my nose too easy. Yeah, and Kane got tickled and macaroni shot out of his nose. <laughs> <laughs> We've had a good laugh over that. And then here are the tuna patties that I had left. I've got, I think I cooked 10. And I have five left, so half of those got eaten. Yeah. Now, time to clean up the mess. The gross, gross mess. You, you, you in my way. So I gotta clean all this up and my dishwasher worked. I've already run one load and I've already got another load on this loaded. No, you're not. Mm -mm, he's been cleaning his ropes in it. And he's put sand all in the bottom of my dishwasher. All right, I gotta clean now. Yeah, this is bad. All right guys, got it clean. Everything is wiped down. Picked up, put away. Looks a whole lot better. <laughs> My stove's actually clean. Yeah. All the dishes are washed. All I gotta do is turn the dishwasher on. I did not sweep the floor. That's gonna wait till in the morning because my feet are swollen for some reason tonight. I may have ate too much salt. <laughs> And I'll just put away these dishes in the morning. I do gotta put that phone up there on the charger. 
that everything is cleaned makes me happy. All right, y'all, that's gonna be it for my video today. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please give me a big thumbs up. I would really appreciate it. And thank you so much for watching and until next time, bye.